Jerry James Stone and you're watching Cooking Stone. On today's show, I'm gonna make I'm gonna make this grilled cheese sandwich, which I think is just the best grilled cheese sandwich ever. It's um, it has asparagus, which I love, and it's in season. Asparagus is everywhere, um, and I have a how-to video on how to blanch asparagus and how to store asparagus. So if you don't know how to do those two things, check out my how-to section. Um, but also on top of that. This sa this grilled cheese sandwich, the top part of it is an egg in a basket. So it's an egg in a basket grilled cheese sandwich. So when you cut into it, you just have this amazing yolk everywhere and it's gooey and cheesy and asparagus. It's just, I can't tell you how many of them. I've eaten so many of them. I mean, you can see how many I've eaten. Um, anyway, I think you're really gonna enjoy it. The first thing we need to do is prep the cheesy part of our grilled cheese sandwich. We're just gonna put some of this Gruyere on the bread slices. So it's all nice and gooey. Now we're gonna add our asparagus, the blanched asparagus. If you don't know how to blanch asparagus, I have a video on this. Just check it out. You'll be a pro in no time, I swear. Now we're gonna add the remaining cheese. It's gonna be nice and gooey. Which every grilled cheese sandwich should be, right? And then we're just gonna stick these in the broiler for a few minutes just to get the cheese all nice and melted. You would typically just do this in the pan, but because this grilled cheese has so many moving parts with the asparagus and the egg in the hole, it's just easier to do it in the broiler first. Now that we've made our egg in the hole, we're gonna take our bottom half with the cheese and the asparagus, add that to the pan. You might need more butter depending on how much you put in. Get that sizzling up. And now let's top off our sandwich. 